so I'm reading a book to my child a couple nights ago and I really wanted to share this story with you. So it's from this book. And it's like, it's, there's a lot of stories here. But they're all short stories. Only a couple pages long. I don't even know how many stories there are. There's got to be like a hundred, two hundred. <laughs> Clearly right on the cover, two hundred. <laughs> I'm Holly and I'm sharing a part of my journey to bring courage and inspire you on yours. And this evening I just want to keep it light. And I'm going to read you a very short story with a great lesson. The Eagle and the Arrow Once upon a time, a mighty eagle was soaring through the air, strong and powerful. Suddenly it heard the whiz of a speeding arrow and felt itself pierced in the heart. The eagle looked down and saw that it was indeed badly wounded, with blood pouring from its breast. Slowly the bird fluttered down to the ground where it lay dying. Looking down upon the arrow with which it had been pierced, the eagle's last thought was the realization that the shaft of the arrow that had been feathered with one of its own plumes. We often give our enemies the means for our own destruction. Look at that. We often give our enemies the means for our own destruction. When are you going to learn? When are you going to learn that some of these people are here for lessons and seasons and not for lifetimes? Usually, the biggest enemies that we have are those that we sleep with, those that we eat with, those that we choose to bring into our homes those that we have closest to us, those can be some of our biggest enemies. Stop feeding and fueling them. Know your worth, accept your value, set those healthy boundaries, and stand your ground. You got it right here. You just need to find it and activate it. Mwah. Blessings to you all.